the drop is right over there. And is that a ship? What is that? Kate, you seeing this? Like, there's a legit this ship over there. Time. Cut it out. Junk in here. Find Agent Blackbird. First of all, I'm actually pretty intrigued with whoever is on that ship. At this point, fuck this mission. I want to find out why there's a ship in the middle of a city. I got Kate with me for a bit. Wait a minute, is that robots? Yo, it's an actual pirate ship. See people over there. How in the hell did a ship get all the way up there? That's what I'm saying, Kate. This doesn't make any sense. I guess I ran into a mission, maybe? Whoa. Are you friend or foe? Scanning. Scanning. Accessing pre-war records. Record found. Driver's license. S9132886264. Lawyer. Are you Lawyer kidding me? Assassin. You are hereby conscripted into the Congressional Army. He just gave away all of my government details. Including my my license. Well, that's new. Pardon, madam. Regardless, the captain requests your presence on the bridge. Have to double quick, madam. Captain. So I did. I did walk into a mission. Kate. Kate. A hey, word, please. This better be worth it. Stop being so aggressive. Hey, need something. Your thoughts? So where are we off to next? We're off to the ship. How do you feel about us? Could be worse. Could be better. What do you want? A daily report? You know, I don't appreciate your smart comments. That so. was all. Sure. Okay, so we're heading inside the ship, I guess. Right? How do we get in? Is there a way for us to get in? Or not? Nah? Huh. I guess not, so we'll head inside the house to see if there's, like, a path already made. The fact that this ship landed on this building, and I'm still in belief that this building has yet to collapse. Like, seriously. This is insane. Okay, but I'm trying to figure out how to get on the ship, Kate. What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do, bro? How do I get on the ship? Okay, let me follow the arrow that's on the map here. Maybe... Hold on. I'll do that. Okay. Let me see if that's the only thing that's being marked, just in case. Help defend the checkpoint? No. I'm not defending no checkpoint. I'm not doing anything. No. Alright, so it's up there, right? How do we get upstairs? I need to know. Because I am a little bit confused as to how I'm able to land inside this ship. Come on. I don't know, Kate. We'll find out sooner or later. Right now, this is just, uh... Just getting inside is becoming a mystery. Oh, up here, right? Right? No? No, seriously, how do I... Do I crawl in? This is a pain in the ass. Scanning. 
And this robot's not helping me either, so... Maybe there's a way for me to get inside that I have yet to figure out. I just hate being confused. Because once I get confused, I get a little bit fussy. Maybe up here? Oh, I see stairs. Okay. So far, so good. I'm just looking around to see if there's anything I need to be aware of. I don't want no hidden surprises, you know? Okay, so this is good. I see some stairs. Wow. There is a whole ship here. Okay. We found the opening. I see more robots in the ship. Oh, there's a smell I'm never gonna forget. Ugh. Kate, you're just smelling yourself at this point. See a lot of junk here. I don't see any money, so I'm disappointed this to say the least. Speaking. We're taking on an allied soldier. Clear the berth, disable the fences, make way. What is in these barrels? I'm curious. Is it food? I hope it's food. Wow, mad robots in this ship. Okay, thank you. Appreciate it. Wow. This is pretty intriguing, to say the least. Ooh, a pumpkin! This ship is so abandoned. Look at this. Is that food? No, there's no food here. This is insane. Stand down. Stand down, I say. But they're not really doing... They're not really doing anything. Okay, so if I'm a guest, then I should be good to go. Cannonballs? Oh my god. And cannons. This is hilarious. This is truly hilarious. This is a big crew of robots. Unidentified. Intruder. Intruder. Mr. First Mate, this is the captain. This soldier is no intruder. Requesting permission to use lethal. Force. Are you serious? Are you serious? He just said I'm a guest. What? You're gonna kill me? We're the only ones that'll be doing the killing around here. Affirmative. Stand down! That's an order! And for God's sake, use the accent! I, Captain. Standing down. Wow, he actually used the accent. I am done. Is this the captain's cabin? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not, I'm, I'm not about to do that. Okay, so it's upstairs. So let's head to the main deck. How in the hell did a ship get all the way up there? Kate, you keep nice asking that question stand. as I if I know much. the answer. Just need a full bottle and some bones to break. You're reminding me of my work wife, personality wise. So this is the dummy thick captain. Holy shit. Ironsides, that... You know what? You actually do look like Ironside. I'm not gonna lie. Captain Ironsides. I'll have none of your lip, Mr. Navigator. Have the crow's nest scan two points off the port bow. Jump to it. Aye, Captain. Our soldier has arrived. I trust the first mate didn't give you too hard a time. Been too long since we've seen the Congressional Army. Wow. I am so... <laughs> I'm so intrigued by this. I, I really am. Are you broken? Why, why the hell are you talking like that? The quaint vulgarity of the common soldier. It warms the circuits. This is the pride of our Navy, the USS Constitution. As her commander, it is my privilege to enforce a certain measure of decorum amongst my crew. 
You didn't explain why you're talking like that. Look around you. In these times of great unrest, is it not prudent to adopt the manner of a more civilized time? If that I mean, answer is not to your satisfaction, I'm afraid you must make your peace with it. You know what? I respect that. It's pretty cute how you're talking like you're from the 1800s. And someone's shooting you. Are you crazy? Do you even know what year it is? Do not mistake my genteel manner for derangement, madam. I am fully aware that it is the year of our lord, 2287. The year of our lord! I love it. Your lookout told me to come up here. Do not think Why? that I confess, we need your assistance. You visit this fine vessel in trying times. We calm these long years on her airy perch. Damn you, Weatherby Savings and Loan! I spit at you. It's always the bank, bro. It's always the bank. That's quite a predicament. Well wow. struck. At least you, you can cannot evade my to keen senses. For what vexes me most is my inability to assist in the war effort. My gun decks have not but more rats and ne'er do wells as targets. Enough pleasantries. The Constitution has systems that need repairs. To I carry just out love its how he's trying to talk, and Fall is just glitching at this point. What war effort? Against communist China, of course. But if China. any Bedcoots or Canadians sail nearby, I will give them a good thrashing, to be sure. To avenge the burning of our nation's capital would be a sweet victory indeed. We gotta so say thrashing like that. They will relay your instructions. Dismissed. Good thrashing, my ass. Scavengers approach. Soldier and the cannons. Kill them only as a last resort. A few warning shots usually suffice to scare them. Oh shit! We're being attacked. Oh! You know what? Let me fire one. Can I fire one or not? Ooh, 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 wait, wait, wait. Let's go. Oh shit! That is so cool. And it has a nice little bell. Oh my god, I love it. Huh, okay. Alright, let me do the cannons again. Move. Damn, look at that. Look at all those scavengers, bro. This is insane. I like how I just walk into a war. Damn. This is insane. We're actually attacking people. Let me look at my little mission brief. So talk with the Busan. Repulse. Oh. Okay. Well, at this point. Am I able to go down here? Oh, shit. I am. Let me see if I'm able to talk to them. Because this is a crazy ass attack. Ooh, I'll take that. Can I? No. Okay, whatever. Maybe it's these people over here? Oh. This is our claim. Clear out, Shivy. Shivy? What the hell is a Shivy? I don't have time for the likes of you. Wait, what's that? Alright, I guess I'll help. Ooh, they caught this person to bits. I didn't even need to do anything. Where's the scavenger? Yes, because I would be the one to come with nukes to end this fight. Who else? Oh shit. Of course I would run into an enemy, a legendary one. Come on, man. Holy cow, this is insane. We're just... Damn. 
I think we're done, right? Yeah? Ooh, shit. So you're the navigator, right? Yo, come back! I'm trying to talk to you! This guy runs faster than... than I could run. Come on. Oh, lord. Bro, wait up! I'm trying to so oh my god, I hate this game sometimes. I'm pressing the talk, but it's not letting me talk. I don't know why. Whatever, I'm just gonna talk to the captain, honestly. Ooh, thank you. I'll get in. Captain, are you okay? You're steaming. Or not. Is there more enemies? Hold on, let me look at my thing again. Talk with the Busan? Maybe I just need to go inside, I'll be back. So you're Busan. Your very presence does this humble unit a great honor. My programming would find it amiss if I did not also interject. Long live the captain! You have so much energy. I am impressed. You certainly have pep. Much obliged for the compliment. But on to the mission of the day. A last marine expedition. Valiantly returned with much needed supplies. Including replacement power cables, madam. Alas, with my severe lack of appendages. I find myself unequal to the task of repairing the cables myself. I'll get right on it. My anxiety emulators are lightning by the microsecond. Once you have resolved this matter, I beseech you to return to me to accept my undying gratitude. This is a very kind robot. I'll take that. Can I replace them? Uh, you replace the broken cable with a new power cable. Holy cow, that's one. Let me uh, go downstairs into the unknown. Got that. Yay! I replaced two of them. Oh my god, I am such a mechanic. Defending the Constitution. The fact that this ship runs on wires, though, I'm pretty... Okay, so the primary p power cables powering many USS Constitution... S S S <laughs> Damn, my bad. <laughs> Systems are badly frayed and damaged. So that's what I've been doing, install new power cables. All right, that was a very easy job. I know the crewmate is going to be impressed with my cable skills, because why not? You know, I've been told I've been good with my hands, so... Hey, Bosun. How course is through the Constitution's veins again! Mm -hmm. Her systems, long starved. Life. <laughs> he has so much energy, I love it. Huzzah! However, this has brought to light further failures in our power grid. The power relay, to my shame, I previously complained about is fluctuating wildly. Why are you ashamed of that? Bad for morale, madam. But there were dark times when I made all manner of baseless complaints against the kitten. The manner in which this ship is run and the plausibility of our sacred mission. But now, I see the error of my ways. And with your help, perhaps I can atone. Power relay coils are a common enough part. Might I recommend checking the local shopkeeps? Surely, they would be of some assistance. Fair winds and following seas. You know, I'm actually gonna try and, rep and repair see if that would work because i really don't want to go to the shops 
A series of power relays distributes power to all ship systems. The voltage is highly erratic because one of the power relay coils is badly corroded. Power relay coils are relatively common and can probably be found in many salvage shops. A significantly skilled repairman may be able to repair the coil, which I am able to. You shut down the power and insert the new power relay coil. You then cycle the power back on. Now the power is steadily throughout the ship. Oh, shit, it's hella bright. Okay, this is good. This, this is going to be really well-functioning at this point. And steady. I would have brought you, but alas, I cannot due to my lack of clapping instruments. You mean huzzah, hands? Madam. Huzzah! 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 Let's go. Well, you're very welcome, Osun. You are too kind. I require no further assistance. But our Mr. Navigator is also beset by troubles. Of course Scuttle he is. Buddies. Our guidance system is on our last legs. If you've not already, speak to him. Fare thee well. Okay, so I assumed he is downstairs somewhere, so let's go. Wee! You know what I say. Into the unknown. How do I get downstairs? Hold on. The other side? Maybe? Yep, right here. Oops, sorry. And, uh, yep, right over here. Let's go. I know exactly who to talk to as well, so no issues. How in the hell did a ship get all the way up there? It seems like that question is continuously baffling you since you keep on repeating it. I mean, I can't blame you, but it's slowly becoming annoying at this point. Navigator. Ahoy, soldier. Scavenger threat eliminated. Damage assessment will commence after this unit has completed scheduled duties. Why did the scavengers attack? Scavengers have attacked ship 17 times. Destroyed 13% of ship's systems. Stole 5% of ship's store. Logic error. Captain's orders authorize scavenger termination only if necessary to preserve the ship. If they've attacked you 17 times, why don't you fight back? This unit suggests Captain's core processes in need of extensive maintenance. Guidance system offline. Multiple errors diagnosed. First error. Guidance chip stolen. This unit requires its return. Who stole your guidance chip? Guidance yeah, chip where is, is one it? entry on the list of stolen items. Reclaim ship at Scavenger's forward recon station. Captain has approved a bounty for its return. Lethal force is prohibited unless absolutely necessary. Aft dinghy unlocked and available for your use, madam. So based off of what I'm seeing on my screen, the guidance ship could be at that same place I was at earlier with the two people. Yep, it's it's them. They have the chip. Don't shoot. Those assholes didn't attack the ship on our orders. They weren't trying to frag ya anyhow. They just wanted to kill the frickin' robots. What? So some of your guys almost got me killed. Yeah, lady. You told those crazy assholes not to attack. It's not our fault. All right. When they saw you waltz right into the Constitution, they just went ballistic. How did you get aboard anyway? We thought you were going to get cratered for sure. I can't really take you seriously with that long ass face of yours, but whatever. He knew I was an American, so he drafted me. America? Yeah. Isn't that some old world mumbo jumbo? It is actually. So Great you description. Got to see the inside, huh? All that salvage. The real mother load. Just waiting to be stripped and sold. 
Is all the junk inside really that valuable? Well, yeah, we could keep Diamond City in parts for months with all them gizmos. We'd never have to scrounge in the gutter again. So you talked with a tin can. What do you have to say? I really doubt you want to do that to help Diamond City because of the fact that I've seen Diamond City and they're actually in a pretty decent shape, so... We talked about a lot of things. Let me guess, he wants his computer chip back, right? Well, too bad. It's our salvage now. You know what he needs it for? His rockets. The huge goddamn rockets on the side of his boat. He's nuts. I'm sure there's a good reason he needs them. You seriously want to help that idiot bolts for brains? Coming Screw from you, that that's a compliment. Robot. Come work with us. There's dozens more of us nearby. It's only a matter of time before we come out on top. I'm not splitting my share with her. You holding out on us, Davies? You got some magical way in there? This lady's got a free ticket aboard, so shut up. Help us destroy that freaking tin can once and for all. No deal. I'm with Ironsides. You're siding with that daft robot? Yep, and Kate, I am. You asshole. You're lucky we don't gun you down. Oh, really? Is that a threat, Mandy? Well, guess I don't what? Have time for the likes of you. Excuse Need me. Something? Talk to Mandy. Those guess what? Are under our Thank you. Orders are pretty clear about these. Nothing personal. Bye. Bye. And you know what? I'm in a mood to kill mad people. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Kate, hold still. Kate, get up. Let's go. Who's shooting? Sometimes you just gotta be very, very aggressive with the attacks. Kate, get up. I yeah. can't kill you, so... All right, let's go. It sucks I had to kill all of them, but you know what? Fuck it. They're annoying anyways. I really doubt anyone would miss them. I know Kate is in disbelief too. She's like, you wanna help the robots? Yes, I do actually. Got a problem? All right, it's right here, so. Let's get this started. Okay. Nice. We did it. Oh, the navigator's right here too. Mr. Navigator. Ahoy, soldier. So recovered. Dispensing bounty. Diagnostics report. One error remaining. Guidance radar's transmitter is non-functional. Requires replacement. What's wrong with the transmitter? Diagnostic inconclusive. No functioning Mr. Handy's available for detailed analysis. Acquire Poseidon radar transmitter at specified map coordinates. Further bounty will be dispensed upon completion, madam. And um, honestly, maybe I can actually replace it. I don't want to go anywhere, so... This is the Guidance Systems radar, which was salvaged from a Coast Guard vessel. Practically all of its components have been repaired or replaced. The only broken components is a burned out Poseidon radar transmitter. It's a rare part that's only used in Poseidon facilities. A master repairman may be able to repair the dead transmitter. All right, let me see. Use soldier circuit boards and splice wires together in the broken radar transmitter. After a few moments, LEDs flicker to life and the radar system reports it is fully operational. Look at that! I didn't even need to go anywhere. Mr. Navigator? Ahoy, soldier! Ahoy. Guidance system fully functioning. Bounty dispensed. Yes. It is required you commence dialogue with the captain, madam. Oh, okay. Come on, Kate, excuse me, thank you. Let me see what he has You've to say. You've service to our noble vessel. Despite ample provocation, I had hoped the guidance chip 
could be recovered without violence to the scavengers. I'm so sorry. And now they plot the retaliation. I would have spared them if I could have. I have no doubt that they made a peaceful resolution impossible. But you did your duty and did it well. I find I must reward your considerable efforts with the final labor. We stand but a hair's breadth away from embarking on our sacred mission. Wait, what? So now, can you tell me what's going on? Complete this task, and I will gladly relate our mission. Until then, silence, vigilance. The ship requires turbo pump bearings from a nearby factory. It will undoubtedly be a dangerous mission, but I have faith you will succeed. Thank you so much for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.